Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another session of Dragon Quest VIII. Now in Norway, this is like the Hyper Norway edition or something like that. Anyway, let's get on with our quest for dragons, shall we? Um, when we last left off, we had acquired ourselves a ship and a crew. Oops, wrong button. <laughs> Still getting used to... Oh my god, where the hell are we? Okay. That was actually quite a bit of a mistake. But anyway, let's sail. Uh, not sure which way. Probably this way, probably. Right? Right? Yeah, then we'll go to the west. Then we'll swim back up, follow the shoreline, and then go straight west from there. Yep, gotcha. Won't take too long, I assure you. The boat is rather fast, as you can clearly see. We are moving rapidly through the waves of the southern continent. Anyway, that is neither here nor there. This is the first Norway episode, as I've probably said like three times already. And it's midnight, because A, I don't sleep, and B, I haven't had a whole lot of time to record recently, you know? There's, there's been there's been the stuff that's been going on, you know, moving back to Norway, as you're probably aware if you watched my second Let's Fill video. Um, and, you know, once I'm here, you know, everyone wants to talk to me, and... Uh, and people want to see me and stuff like that, so it doesn't leave a whole lot of time for the, the good old recordings, you know? So I probably need to allocate more time than only weekends to this, because as it stands, weekends are not really enough to pump out, you know, sufficient amounts of, you know, video material, if you will, and still being able to have a backlog. And I, I really like having a backlog, because, you know, it's nice having something to fall back on because as it stands currently I barely have enough footage to you know make it through the week I have to skip several days in order to you know oh you would do that holy shit you ultimate scum lords okay <laughs> we know who to focus now don't we yeah the ocean has um, shall we say some rather unique enemy types oh you would keep attacking there wouldn't you they have some rather unique uh, enemy types and the difficulty kind of spikes here. Not just because of the amount of enemies you face, but also the different kinds of enemies you face as well. As we will see as we progress further into the storyline, there are some mighty and terrible beasts lurking in the depths, one of which we have to face in order to progress the storyline, because it shall unlock a path, but we shall get there when we get there. No need to spoil all the fun, right? Suffice it to say, there is a mighty beast below, and we do not want to encounter it before we have to. Suspense. Probably need to heal after this, too. We're, we're going to be uh, low on the old resources when we get to the western continent, aren't we? Jesus Christ, man. Yeah, I don't like it. They have a high evasion stat too. And Ducky is awake too for the first time in the Norway recordings. Yeah, she is uh, about as active as me in the evening hours, I think. Mostly because she wants to be included in all the fun, you know, and can't really blame her. Recording is all the funs. Just wish I had A, more time to record, and B, someone to record with. Uh, how are we doing anyway? Yeah, we're, we're moving fairly quickly. We're about one centimeter on the old world map. There'll probably be some treasure chests that we pass um, in the shoreline as well. Had I been a smart fox, I would have actually teleported to like one of the uh, one of the ports and headed west from there. But uh, ahead of us there, if you saw before... Ooh, sirens. Hey, hey. Before um, we transitioned into the battle here, you could see Neos. The island of Neos. That's where all the good stuff is, you see. That's where the golden golems are. Oh, goodness. Oh, my. This could be interesting. Oh, my God, he's doing the shepherd dance. Oh, <gasps> did you see? He's doing the shepherd dance. Which means he really isn't dancing at all. But, <laughs> you know, can we get a puff puff dance before we end the battle here? Oh, my goodness. I, I don't really know how to react to that. Hopefully she won't attack. Should have probably focused her though. Would have been uh, would have been smart, wouldn't it? Crap. Let's um, let's hit it with some uh, specials here. It's because oh man, please don't attack. Uh, that's not enough damage. 
You can do it. I believe in you. You can be the real MVP. That was not enough damage. It's going to attack now, isn't it? Ooh. Hey, hey. <laughs> Just the way we like it. Oh, yes. Quite so. We, we do like the Puff Puff dance. Speaking of, we shall be paying the club Puff Puff a visit too after the game. Because I think that's when it unlocks. I'm not entirely sure. I need to read up on that. I must admit, have not been there in my single player games. Well, this is definitely single player, but my off camera early days recordings, playings, whatever. You get what I'm saying. And you know, we receive a ha handsome amount of experience as well. Can't really complain though, but uh, no, no real point in healing after that. So yeah, we have Neos ahead of us, and we shall shortly be turning northwards, and we shall continue following the shoreline. I really like the boat music. I, I will admit that. That is some finely crafted music indeed. As is pretty much all music here, I, I must admit to you. If you pay attention and you see the island straight ahead of us to the north there, and you can see the X there, you're not mistaken that's a side quest with some alternate, not alternate, but optional bosses. As far as I am aware, there are at least two sets of alternate optional pardon me, bosses in the game, to my knowledge anyway. Might be more, you know. Never know with me. Now we're fighting anchors too, because oh my god, they do a lot of damage. We might actually have to run here if we keep attacking the low level party members. Was, oh Jesus Christ. Okay. We, <laughs> we need to. Um, we should probably have uh, people buffing. They don't have a lot of health though. Which uh, both pleases and concerns me. Let's try a metal slash. Does Jessica have. Defenses, no, but she reduces the defense of one, so let's do that. By 92. That should produce results, shouldn't it? Well, yeah. enough for the Falcon Slash to be effective anyway. That is the way. Aha, uh -huh, we like it, as they say. Oh, I fucked up my headset there. Hold on. There we go. Yeah, my headset's getting old. I'm using a Travel Boot X11 headset, I think, and, um,. Uh, it's seen better days, to put it that way, but haven't all Total Beach headsets, right? Let's see now, let's do the heals. And I've totally forgotten to put the timer on, but we shall shortly correct this. We can probably just head right past here. We see the western continent off in the horizon there. This is Neos. Who's this Neos? This is Neos. Oh, that's the other island. This is actually Neos. Pardon me, and oh. I know better now. That is the alchemy pot finishes. If you remember in the last episode, we combine a moth, moth dagger with a gold ring, and we get a full moon ring. Aha. An exceedingly rare item indeed. Now, before we do anything else, I'm going to combine up these things, which should provide us with a special medicine, which will be enough to... Uh, Oh, which will fulfill the requirements for the first black market mission in back in Pigham. Which is why I started there, because I want to check that. There we are. Let's see what the full moon ring does. Resistant to paralysis. Paralysis, pardon me. Can I just equip that? Hell yeah, 10 extra defense plus paralysis um, resistance. I will gladly take that. Um, there is kind of like a, almost a lock, I wouldn't say a lock, but like a river that goes straight into the western continent here, and if I remember correctly, that's where I've disembarked on my previous playthroughs, so we shall do that today as well. We shall, um, adhere to tradition, if you will, because, <laughs> uh, if I'm not mistaken, that's where we need to go, we need to get to, is it Argonia? Oh, that's a bit of a more funky dance, is it? I, l I really like how the boobs kind of jiggle when they attack. It's, uh, what can I say? It's pleasant. Oh my. Kind of hurts too. Hell yeah! I am putting on some moves. Anyway, we should probably uh, kill these things. Thank you. Before it's too late. And I'm focusing the wrong enemy type here too, which is... Uh, Necessarily, that well, she's she's psyching up now, though, so now it's the right enemy type. But 
We should probably switch targets to the Sea Angels, as they tend to resurrect, as we have seen before. Should we get more dance? Ah, she doesn't care. Like most females, they don't give two shits. Single tier. Oh, you would accelerate. You accelerate the crap out of yourselves. I'm looking forward to learning Accelerate, actually, because it's uh, mighty vital during boss fights. Oh, lovely. Lovely, lovely. Just nullify everything I've done, why don't you? Yeah, by all means. Not like I care. There we go, now I can waste them. Waste these suckers. Please, for the love of God, I'm running out of things to talk about. Almost. Almost. You would. Just like a one final middle finger to the player before, yeah, oh, we are almost dead too. I was psyched up though, but, but I'm not sure if that affects magic. I'm not entirely sure actually, but there we go. Finally. Goodness gracious me. 23. Welcome, Angelo. To level 23. We got three skill points that we can allocate wherever we see fit. There we are. And nobody cares. Okay. It would be nice if we could learn a uh, party heal, but uh, it's in the makings. At some point, sooner or later. Okay, let's go. It's not too far. We can actually see it on the closed map now, so um, could go there as well. But I think we can disembark in here. Actually, I think we see our destination right up ahead here. Yes. Could this be the fabled hilltop? Church, cathedral, whatever, monastery. That's probably the right word. Oh, but who knows? Not like we can run away from the silly gargoyles. Oh, no, pardon me. These guys are hawkmen. I forgot to heal. Crap! Okay, let's uh, do short work of these gentlemen then. I have the mana. Oh, wait. Oh, they're separate things. Let's do that guy then. Nope, uh, he doesn't care. He cares not for the twax. Oh, uh, did I say they throw magic out? Uh, uh, <laughs> no, stop it, please. Okay, we got one of them. It would be nice if we could get the other ones too. I'm almost dead. Help me, Jesus. Okay, uh... I'll use mid, med heal, and you just fuck them up, basically. Thwack has proven to be uh, ineffective at best. Just live. It's all I ask. As long as Angelo lives, you know, we don't really care. Oh, she actually took that. She took it like the man she is. I mean, what? Oh, that could be mad. Okay, we're almost done. We're almost done, I promise, guys. I should probably start my timer, too. Almost done. Please. I've embarrassed myself enough this episode, as it is. 300 experience there, so... Nothing to sneeze at. Nothing to sneeze at, indeed. Now, for some manly healing. That's the wrong target, but okay. Didn't want that mana anyway. There we go. Now... Let's disembark near the church, shall we? Because this is where we're actually supposed to go, believe it or not. Disembark, please. Thank you. Here we go! At long last! Oh, welcome, guys, to the Western Continent. We've, we've never been here before. No. Never been here at all, actually. Oh, man. Never! N oh. I spy with my little eye something that begins with a T and ends with... Resha chest. Ah, oh, great saber cats. Oh my god. Spoilers, we get to ride one of those later. <laughs> yeah. They, they deal damage. There's actually one of the cooler enemy types in the game, to be fair. They're kind of badass. I mean, they're saber cats, for Christ's sake. Look at it. The great saber cats. Pardon me. Easily defeated, though. Still kind of badass. A mighty 30 damage. Such power. Much grace. Wow. Screw the rules. I have money. Well, I have mana. 
Goes for the same. Let's thwack him. But they don't care. Because it's thwack. And it never works. See, this is why I never thought thwack was actually, you know, a decent thing. And there's why. Because it's kind of shit. Yeah. I don't know what the percentage is. Or if some enemies are immune to the effects of thwack. You know, that's also a possibility, obviously. But, I don't know. It's... It is what it is. It's an insta kill move that works like 20% of the time. By my estimates, anyway. So, yeah. We are at the Hilltop Monastery. No. We shall check out that treasure chest later. But for now, enter! Wow. Oh, this kind of like Luster, isn't it? Can we save here? You have a silly hat! Look at it! He's a green silly hat. Probably offending multiple religions at this point, but it is kind of a silly hat there. Argonia, let's go there again. Let's not go to Argonia. Argonia is a silly place full of silly people. It was a waste of half an episode, but at least we got loot supports though, so I'm not really complain. Well, it was a waste of six minutes. What is six minutes in the eye of the beholder anyway, right? I can probably rest here too, but... Let's check things out, just in case. Nothing of interest. Big burly man sitting by the kitchen table. Nothing new there. Can we actually rest here? I don't know if we can. Let's loot the place. It is only a church. They're rich anyway. You'll know what I mean later. Can we actually... And now you're gonna... Now you're gonna... Lecture me about skill points. 25 levels into the game now. Wow. Game. It's like you thought I wouldn't level up. Oh. He's not been able to sleep. And he saw a jester running across the water. He pulled the juices on these guys. He was probably heading to Baccarat. The gambling town. Some kind of phantom. Close enough. Did you hear that? Must be talking about Golmagus. Let's go to Baccarat. Corbly. <laughs> oh man, uh, there should be some more cutscenes here though. Follow the road. You get to Baccarat. Lovely. What's up here? Is there anything good? Clamp, 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 clamp. Hola! No. 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 Nothing good. Does he have anything else to say? We laddie? No, no, let's go to Baccarat then. Let's head on to Baccarat, shall we? With that little pointer. <laughs> because anyone who just starts up the game would have known to go there, right? Let's talk to these guys too, why not? This church was built for traveling pilgrims. Lovely. Oi, little shit. And you saw it, you know what I mean? The man ran across the water. Yep, we know, little man, we know. Anyway. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. Kind of a botched episode, but whatever. And I shall see you in the next one. Good day.